Okay, a certain scientific Rogan T episode one. The start of the Daihase Festival arc, which is gonna go on for an unknown amount of time. Let's see. Mikoto is walking, she has to help some kids with a broken toy, but she does that pretty fast. She meets up with Kuroko at the hospital. Meets up with Sadanui Haru, who go visit Kuroko, who's at the hospital from the, uh, second arc of, wait, no, 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 it's a true diagram of an arc from Index 2, that's where she got her injury from, uh, let's see. Uh, they talk, we meet uh, the committee for, we see the committee for the Daihase Festival as they're trying to get the level fives. Half of this episode's filler, half of this episode's chapter 43, I believe, from the Daihase Festival work. But that's basically it for the filler besides that one scene in the open of next episode and I know of before it gets back to the straight canon stuff immediately <laughs> we also see the new OP uh, I don't know the new OP uh, the next but back focus on this episode let's see Mikoto is fight <laughs> right now Grokro at uh, committee is context level fives it starts to show cock <laughs> Shikaku sounds a little different. Zaki, uh, I don't know. Uh, well, uh, they're contacting the other level fives. Mugina was like, no, and she decided to bash poor Frunda's head into the table. Uh, she was like, mm, maybe. I <laughs> she was trying to see what it was. <laughs> Dark matter, uh, cocaine was. <laughs> I can't remember his name because they didn't talk about it. It's been a while. He gets an English voice actor now. I mean, he gets a voice actor now, period. <laughs> can't remember the name of the Japanese voice actor, but you know, uh, Japanese voice actor equals English voice actor, so he has a voice actor now, period. <laughs> Gunha also now has a voice actor. No, his, he just appeared in the anime. Uh, oh god, I'm going through this so slow. But he sees it's a mess. Uh, Goku Sai Kayabi uh, says that Goku Sai, I'm just gonna call Goku Sai, uh, that his power would meet well with kids and sort of TV. Uh, Childlike version of Dark Matter with Chibi Angel thingy, Chibi Kids with Angel Wings out, his wings out, his Dark Matter wings. So through a brick, oh god, this stuff one's gonna last a while, ain't it? Uh, that one guy who was trying to get him, he's like, I'm busy, <laughs> I don't want to do that, to, I don't want to hate. So he's like, I'm done with that stuff. Koto runs into Mizaki, the Fifth rank level five, you met her in the first episode of Rogan S. Uh, they talk for a while. She's gonna be much more active this season. So, you prepare to see more of her this time around compared to the last season. Uh, Mikoto runs into her sister at a store. <laughs> Some people want to stuck them for twins. 
and uh, she got uh, an extra one and gave it to Mikoto since she got four, five and she uh, got there was four sisters that she was getting it for herself included in the four <laughs> Koto is uh, really hard when it's trying to stop these people are fighting and arguing uh, she almost gets hit, but it's, uh, it's right in front of her face, so she doesn't. And we hear some guy talk, he says, whether you're a boy or a girl, <laughs> it's all about Gets or something like that. Gets, Gets, Gets. His name is Gahuna Sagita. I don't know how to really pronounce his name. He's a 7th rank level 5. He doesn't have a nickname like the other ones. He saw the name of the 6th rank level like, 5, Ihara Etsu. I don't know how to really pronounce it, but I think that's as close as I'm going to get with his name. Or either of their names. <laughs> and he uh, talks. <laughs> they brought up the Russian mall demonstration from SS2 in this. Uh, yeah, there's, uh, that's that. And Mikoto, yeah. Uh, he does his attack, which he shouts out like a shonen protagonist. He sort of acts like a shonen protagonist and says amazing punch. <laughs> I don't know his power. He doesn't know his power. No one knows his power. Maybe the author. Kamachi may know his power, but that's about it. <laughs> yeah, then he dumb clips away. Uh, there was an already uh, edited version where it's uh, Mario and he double clips. Oh well. Oh god, this review is uh, one of the longest reviews for a singular episode I've done. One of the longest. I should have expected for that. My love for again. Oh well. Uh, let's see. Yeah. He uh, does that. And uh, we heard when suddenly getting people out of the way. She said she got anti theory already. Son tries to help the red get crushed, and Rogan shoots it up in the air with the first Rogan, then cuts in half. Shoots it in half with the second gun. Also, did this cool scene where it showed the level five uh, like text in Japanese with the level five thing in English. For the six level fives that appeared in this anime, as this episode, yes, six out of the seven level fives appeared. I doubt we're ever gonna see uh, a number six anytime soon. I mean, he, he made a cameo and. In the NT10, but it was just his hand and thing. Is hers. We don't really know the gender of the six ranked either. There's a ton of people posing as the six ranked as referenced earlier in this episode. Yeah. She forgot her thing on top of it. Uh, teacher Ronnery, who uh, made a cameo in like in season one. Um, I don't made a cameo in season one as well. I'm not gonna talk much about the preview since uh, I've been going on about how long uh, this update for a while. <laughs> yeah, but otherwise. Uh, Let's see. Oh yeah, Mizaki was talking to one of the guys involved with the sisters. I mean, the level six shift project that you saw. He was in the sisters arc of last season. Don't remember his name. Oh well. And yeah, what else was there? Oh yeah, Mikoto, when Sun walked in on that Kuroko, we hired a little behind and. And she got the thing, the three that she got from her sister, which I believe is 1032. Uh, 10,032, I believe. Uh, she got up and uh, revealed a, her photo stash of Burry Burry. Yeah, and before that cuts to, uh, before anything happens, it cuts to the committee for the, the Hase Festival, and, uh, uh, 
and uh, let's see. What else is there? Uh, yeah, the so they decided on uh, Gunha and Huna, or, or, or the Huna and uh, Mizaki for the scene, and shows you her walking in and seeing uh, Mizuko Mizuko Mikoto zaps uh, Kuro Kuro. So yeah, there's that. So that number seven level five has finally appeared in the anime, and yeah. Animation-wise, I say it's around Rogan S, so much better than Accelerator, which is better. Well, Accelerator anime is better than Accelerator manga, obviously. Yeah, it's better than that. Again, Accelerator manga is not good. That good of a Taro series. It's actually the low end of the Taro series. <laughs> The anime is better than the manga, though. There's a filler added to it. So it's not bad, really. <laughs> and also, it had a much better opening than the other manga due to the filler episode of the first one. <laughs> Being an instructor episode or episode one of ex chapter one of Exiler just for your mix. <laughs> and the next week, yeah, it was rushed as shit. <laughs> bad animation. Uh, nine volumes and 26 episodes. Oh well. Yep, but uh, that's Rogan T episode one. Super powered, uh, those things, these with level five in between them. I don't know what they're called. Yeah, well, never play I don't know what they're called. Next episode is the Daihase Festival, so see you for the review for that next week. Oh god, this is the longest review I did for a single 